Today I want to show you the auto fit text command in PowerPoint that allows you to have a single column um, text in a, within a placeholder and you can easily convert it into two columns within a matter of a couple clicks and using the auto fit or stop fitting text within a placeholder. So let me show you that this is a placeholder holder. If you don't know, you know what it is, it's actually the box that is around the text and it's actually different from a text box. Now, when you click on layout, and when you look at the different themes, notice how each one of these have placeholders for the slide. And that, again, I'll show you a little bit later on how that's different from a text box. But in this one, the default size is 36. And we're going to add some text by using the RAN command, five paragraphs in three sentences, and I'm going to press enter. So to get to activate the auto fit command in the bottom left hand corner, you can click on it. Notice I have the option to change to two columns. So once I do that, I still have the two columns, but it is exceeding the placeholder. Well, that's where the auto fit text placeholder come into play that when you, once you click on it, that the font will resize and fit everything inside that box. Now I'm going to create a new slide for you and I'm going to show you the difference between a text box. So I'm going to go ahead and remove this placeholder. I'm going to insert a text box, add it onto the page. Now I'm going to add um, text Notice how all the text stays within that box. So you don't get that auto fit um, option. So I just want you to know that there is a difference because it is a box around it and they look very similar. For more PowerPoint tricks and tips, follow me at Track Creation 4E, where we explore, experiment, and execute effectively.